Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part two of Anthem Demo on the Xbox One X. We are exactly where we were at the end of part one, and we're about to head into this next expedition. Let's crack straight in. It'll be interesting to see how that gold coinage clocks up, because I really hope it's not an in-game purchasing thing, and that it is stuff that you earn as you run through the game, which is what we all want to see, really. It'll be also interesting to see, because I noticed in the demo you can't actually create a character. You've just got to pick whether or not you were a man or a woman, voice-wise, so... And... Inverse... Investigate the relic effects on Matthias. Seems reasonable. Here you can select any of your available missions, strongholds, or free play. Start a free play game by selecting a Strider icon. Alright, okay, so free play allows you to explore the world. Free play sessions are always public. You can play with friends by inviting them to a squad. Alright, so we can either go on the mission or we can just have a wonder about the world. But we'll go on the mission to keep it focused for now, because on top of which, can't even bloody fly at the minute, so exploring the world might not be that much fun, to be fair. I think that's where we were, isn't it? Quick play allows you to join an expedition with spaces available, you can select missions or strongholds to activate quick play for any ongoing missions or strongholds completed. The squad may blah blah blah. Uh, well, I want to do the missions, so... Well, quick play is the only option I've got. Okay, I'm highly confused. <laughs> I've selected the mission. I've highlighted the mission. Now what do I do? Ah, okay. What? Jesus Christ, just let me play the mission. What on earth is going on? See, that's Academy Ruins. That's the old mission, isn't it? Start Expedition. Well, this is highly confusing. I don't know what the feck this is. Let's come out and go back in, people, because I'm completely confused. Right, inverse functions is what we want to be doing. Then we end up here, and then I get completely stuck.
All it says at the bottom left is X to quick play. And all I get is that menu, so I don't know what that's all about. Although it is red, isn't it? In writing. Oh, they all are, though, to be fair. Ah, there we go. It's on inverse functions now. So why was it on the other one earlier, then? That was just weird. Oh, well, that wasn't highly confusing at all, people. All vanity items in the demo cost 25 coin. Which means in the real game, they'll probably cost about 100 million coin. I'm a massive believer, though, that gaming should have evolved from this sort of loading screen now, though. You know, like Destiny at least gives you the flying ships and stuff that make it interesting and beautiful to look at. Even if you are in a loading screen, you don't necessarily feel like you're in a loading screen. Whereas this is just, it's a bit like Zelda. Like you, you go into a lift in Zelda and you're just looking at writing on a screen. It's just, you know, I think we're beyond that now in the world of gaming. You can be a bit more thoughtful about those moments. Whoa, fuck me, just got slaughtered there by something. What the fucking hell? I'm gonna die here, because I've no idea what's fucking killing me. Dear Lord. So if you die, this is what you've got to look forward to, is it? A massive loading bar at the top of the screen. Why do I feel like I'm not on the mission I should be? And that I'm doing the same mission again? Yeah, recover the manifold from the chamber. I've already done this. Why am I doing this again? The 
This makes no sense, people. We've ended up in the same thing all over again. Whoa! How the hell am I flying all of a sudden? That is awesome. I don't know how I did it. I feel like I'm on my own here. Ah, I know how you fly. <laughs> Into a wall. So basically you hit the jump button and then you hit the you click the stick. I don't know how long you can stay up there for, but you basically go boom and boom. Lovely. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah, he seems to have an overheat on it as well. Not sure how that works. in this chamber were behaving strangely. They seemed confused. But enough about that. We should move on and figure out how to get the manifold. Found the manifold, but it's protected by some kind of barrier. It's linked to the entire shaper structure. For some purpose. You must break the link before the manifold can be removed. Interact thing, that's what it was. Interact with it. Barriers down. Be as careful as you can. The manifold is fragile. And dangerous? Probably that too. Got it. On my way back. I can't believe it. We did it. See you soon. Right, well, I'm still none the wiser as to why I've ended up in the same fucking mission. Anyway. See if we can figure it out, people. Not sure if it gives you any coin at this point. Gets your XP.
Well, it could be a little bit clearer, couldn't it, as to what the hell you're doing. Hopefully it won't force us into going back to see the guy again. If it isn't my favorite freelancer. I hear you've been busy. I try. You got Matthias back safe and sound. That's a three for one save right there. I had a good feeling about you ever since you turned up. Keep proving me right, okay? The fort's home, I protect it. Fort's home, gotta look out for it. No argument here. It's good you settled in. Not everyone does. And I'm guessing Fort Tarsus wasn't in your plans before. Well, the heart of rage. I didn't know what would happen then, or where I'd land after. Turns out it was here. Happy you stuck around? Yeah. I'm not sure what I expected, but this place grows on you. I wasn't meant to be here myself. I was on a strider out of Heliost. Supposed to end up in Antium. What happened? Cataclysm. The sky turned yellow, ground changed under us. The survivors were brought here. You never got to Antium? Didn't have the means to try again at the time, and now? I got good work, had a kid. The fort's home. Glad you feel the same. When you're here, anyway. Which reminds me, I should run checking your javelin before you're off again. Thanks, so. I'll see you around. Right, come on, how do we, uh... Ah, right, hang on. Yeah, that's the mission. The only one I've got is Academy Ruins. I wonder if it's just, that's all we've got just now. I can't seem to do anything else other than launch the Academy Ruins, which is the same mission over and over again. But weirdly, I had another mission before this. Ah, here we go. So how do I change it from that to that? I thought I did do, though. Yeah, inverse functions. Normal difficulty, start expedition. Well, let's hope it works out better this time. I mean, you feel like they've put a lot into this game, so <laughs> you're kind of hoping it's going to work out for them. Get the distinct impression that coin is only earned by buying it with cash, though. Didn't see anything to do with coin on return from that mission. Unless, you, unless it's done by salvaging your stuff, right now. Investigate the relics effects on Matthias. We are all here and able to speak to you. Oh, wonderful. Isn't it? Oh, I do hope you find something fascinating back at the ruins. Shaper instruments. Never a dull moment. That's better. There we go. Woohoo! I think that thing at the bottom is your uh, overheat. 
So you can fly for so long and then you need to drop down for a bit. The Dominion so far. Maybe this will be an easy mission. That's Ooh, hello. Not gonna Can't you let <laughs> Just as the flying was getting good. Another cutscene, another bloody loading screen. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I think it's because I got dragged through, isn't it? Oh, we like big eggs, big yellow glowing pussy eggs, people. That's what Watch we like. Out the scorpions in the area. Must have moved in recently. Better do something about them. They'll get in the way of your investigation. Stay down. It looks like that green shit might hurt. Oh, hello. Now shit's getting real, people. It's a bit kind of cross between Gears of War and Destiny, isn't it? Oh, he got blowed up bad. Like this fight. Looks like we've cleared out the scorpions. That'll make it easier to continue the investigation. Those are not normal remains. Looks like some kind of goo. Blood. It doesn't look like blood to me. Decomposition? Too quick. Unlikely. Perhaps the metaphor. Side effect of division? Let's get some samples. Agreed. hypothesis that the split in warped reality there are side effects runa call specializes in that she's on expedition helping the sentinels on it <laughs> airwolf nice <laughs> Get a bit carried away with me flying now, people. Come on now with the loading screens. Jesus Christ. I don't like talking about loading screens, people, but this is getting ridiculous. Oh, stop, start, stop, start, stop, start. Bad news. Relax. We shouldn't jump to conclusions. So you're just gonna sit around. Where are you going? What's happening? Can this argument wait until I get back to the fort? Sumner's left. He just got up and left. But left the lab? I don't know. Just find a room call. We'll deal with this back here. Again, I don't know if it was because it all got so ahead of me and they changed areas or what, but really no need for bloody loading screens like that. Navigating the world. Ooh. 
bloody awesome though when you get flying people. It really is. The Sentinels are under attack from Scars. They're going to need your help. Yellow moves going up a bit fast again. Holy shit. Flank time. Make it for overheat. It's looking a bit tight, people. Prison the kidnapped arcanists. The scars have them in cages here. The cooldown's quite quick though, which is pretty pretty sweet. Whoa, what the hell did he just go? Yeah, it seemed to give me an option to move up and down and my items when I picked up a, a rare item there, a common item. Out of ammo? For me. It's not good, is it?
prisoners here. Nice. I wasn't looking forward to whatever that Iskar I had planned for us. A rude call. Yeah? That's me. How did you... Matthias Sunder sent me. He needs you to... Oh, that jerk. Um, to analyze this? Where did you get this? The energies it's giving off. I can evaluate this data back at the fort. I'll take Aruna and the rest of the prisoners in the Strider. You should take out that Iskar I he mentioned. Kidnapping? Sounds like bad news. Do we know what this Iskari looks like? Possession said it was huge and dangerous. Let's go! Found the Iskari we're looking for. We have oh, to fuck. take it down. High ground, people. High ground. Have it! Oh! Easy there. He's a big Trouble here. Holy shit, what the fuck was that? Yeah, head on with those guys ain't a good idea, is it? High ground, people. High ground. Christ's sake. The shit. What the hell could be hitting me here? <laughs> really? It's outrageous. I don't even know what the fuck is hitting me. That's it. Iskaro trouble dealt with. Good work. Head back to the fort and we'll see if Aruna discovered anything about those samples. Oh. All right. That was quite good fun, actually. I like that level. The enemies are getting more varied, which is quite nice as well. I do like a bit of enemy variety. We've had what spidery things, scorpion things, egg things.
soldier things, tank things, shield things. <laughs> so if that's what we're getting in the demo, hopefully there'll be a lot more even in the full game. The full game, by the way, is out 22nd of Feb, I think. It's not far away. It's whether or not the end game's worth it, really, if it's, you know, story-wise is worth seeing through how long you can play it for where it's still worthwhile. I expect there'll be a lot of DLC for this game, though, season passes and all sorts. Never-ending money pit like Destiny. Ooh. Pilot level increase. New javelin unlock. Nice. I see if you're picking up a lot of stuff like that I'm not using. Yeah, see, I think from here you can basically collapse what you don't want to don't want to keep. Frag grenades, shield reinforcement. I still haven't figured out how to put all this stuff on, have I? Well, that looks better than that one, doesn't it? So. Deploys a spherical shield that blocks projectiles over Ranger's position. Increases javelin armor. It's fire grenade, is it? Yeah. Sniper rifle, assault rifle, heavy pistol, grenade launcher. Yeah, I need to suss out how I equip all this stuff. Just seem to use the one weapon at the minute. You must better swap between them. Take another look at the four. Could you really? <laughs> God's sake! It's a fucking menu system. You don't need a loading screen for a menu system. Right, so we've got. Alright, oh, just a new javelin unlocked. Does it mean I can just unlock whichever one I want then? Interceptor. Beast. Ranger's the one I've got. Storm's the electricity one, I think. Yeah, you can unlock. Just basically unlock anyone you want, really. Unlock Brilliant the Storm choice. one, I think. Lightning at your fingertips? Fearsome. The seals the Storm utilizes are based on tech smuggled in from Stralheim. Dominion tech? Helios engineered an Arcanist enhanced to use the Dominion's knowledge against them. Delicious revenge. I can't wait to try it out. Just remember, the storm can't take damage like a big stompy colossus. No fist fights with turrets, then. Fist fights are for drunken idiots. You get to harness the elements. Throw fire, freeze your enemies. If the Arcanists help build it, have you ever tried using one? <laughs> I'm not a Lancer. I did slip into a javelin once for a moment. Didn't like the way it made my butt look. No worries, I'm sure you'll make it work. <laughs> ah, right, okay. So on A, we've got a load of slots now, look. So we can put these... So we've got armor reinforcement, we've got ammo compartment, heat sink. Ah, 
Increases the javelin's heat capacity by 10%. Means you can fly longer. Have a bit of that action. And then you unlock more of these slots as you go, which is quite smart. You can have more perks. Next one's at level 14, and then you've got to go all the way up to 30 for that one. Nice. Like it. I assume you'll get more slots and other compartments as well. Yeah, here we go. Uh, well, that says slot one, nothing equipped. There you go. Deploys a spherical shield that blocks projectiles. Nice. Nothing equipped on there. Weapons. Yeah, so we've got one weapon on at the minute, which is the Defender, which isn't that good. So let's get a better weapon on. Light machine gun, assault rifle. I thought I picked up a better assault rifle. Don't seem to have. Oh, I have. Hammerhead. Get that on. Change weapon to... Well, we could have the shotty or the pistol. That's the light machine gun. Compact shotgun. Uncommon shotgun. Let's have it. You can craft stuff as well. You can craft items by pressing A if you have a specific rarity of the blueprint unlocked. What was that? Craft re relentless. Ah, right. So this will be the this will be the um the, the scrapping of stuffs for then. So we could actually have, oh hello, rare embers to create that. Epic, nice. That's really nice. I like that idea. Actually, grenades. Yeah, it's got a plus symbol on it. Currently using those, but we've got level fourteen grenades and flame grenades. Assault launcher. Don't think we've got anything better, have we? Same thing. That's it, I think. That's as much as we can do. Nice, though. Now, here's where it gets fun. Time to make a statement. And change the paint job. Oh right, okay. Really I thought I had to have the Got white at the minute. It's quite smart, isn't it? I don't know what that's doing, but it's not the colour that seems to be in front of me. But anyway. 
they all seem to be pluses for some reason. They've just been added. Take the yellow out. Quite like the yellow though. T ter tertiary hard. Whoa, that's some nice white, isn't it? Well, we could spend a while in here, people. Basically doing every level of the, the suit colours, aren't you? Oh, that's your avatar type stuff, your mo motion stuff. Oh, that was the vinyls. That's what I was thinking of there. That's what you needed money for those, I thought. That's quite smart. Yeah, I don't seem to have any more coin than I had before, so we're not earning coin, are we? That's alright though, you can still change the appearance without the vinyls though, which is quite good. And then we've got our Storm character. Ooh, hello, look at that. Bit of a beast. Whoa, how did I get in there? Ah, right, okay. That's primary soft and that's... Uh... Okay, so of that... Nice, check that out. So you can basically go right in and start changing them straight off the bat then. The Black Vengeance. Hey. Nice, like that. Doesn't seem to be any restriction. I mean, they might be locked in the main game, but certainly for now you can go in and do what you want. So the top section is basically what you've used most recently. Yeah, you go for the camo look, I suppose. That's interesting then, if I go for the secondary colour on... Ooh, hello. Smart, innit? So this question is, which one's the cape? 
We don't know the answer, do we? Well, that's blackish. Oh, that's got two colours. Yeah, it's a cape. So what did the second part of that do? Let's have a look. Ah, oh, it's pattern textures, I think. You can make some mad combos with that, can't you? Very nice. Right, well, we'll leave it at that for now. There's probably something that does the helmet and the visor as well, but... Uh, does it keep the... We need to go into the loadout, actually. Does it keep... running smooth. No, you, so you've got two different loadouts here now. I think. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Where, oh, there's weapons there. Right, so you can only have... I've got the hammerhead on the other character already, so I don't think I can have it on both. Oh, maybe. Might have to check if it's taken it off the other one, though, if that's the case. Took the cooldown, didn't we? Yeah. Extra flying power. I think that's it. Go see the dude. Don't seem to be able to run in here. It's a little bit annoying. How's the javelin? Movement's a bit different from the last pair. Mm. Good, you're here. Those samples you brought me, what were they? Well, they used to be Dominion. I thought it might be something like that. Reality decay is not pretty. Reality decay. When a shaper instrument taps into the anthem, it affects reality, and reality is a lot less stable than you think it is. One incorrect variable and the entire equation collapses. Reality collapses. These Dominion, Whatever happened to them altered their nature, the fundamentals of their existence. But it wasn't right. Something wasn't right. They couldn't last. What's this got to do with Matthias? Whatever happened to these Dominion happened to Matthias too. You're not saying... The manifold affected him. It means he, uh, they, are unstable and in real danger. I gotta go. Gods, I could really use a soothing cup of tea. A soothing cup of tea. Right. I 
I have to say, all round though, I've really enjoyed it. Uh, it's just going to be whether or not it holds your interest and keeps things getting interesting. You're back. That is, that is you, isn't it? Yep. I can't quite focus my eyeballs. Where's Sumner? And where's the manifold? He was impatient. He wanted to pursue his own theory. He took it and pushed me. Not hard, but it hurt my feelings. What did Aruna <laughs> say? The Dominion soldiers were affected by some kind of reality decay as a result of their divide. Reality shifting in unintended ways. As a result, they were wobbly. Jelly that didn't quite set. Oh, that explains why I'm feeling oddly porous. It's, uh, it's not a great feeling. And none of my limbs work right. We need Sumner back. And the manifold. The generator of the effect must be part of the solution. Do you know where he went? He talked about needing a drink. Maybe the bar? It's start. How long do I have? I smell burnt toast. Not long. Please hurry. Lady Curdia and Commander Vool, huh? The gossip's everywhere. Fort Tarsus' power comes. It's a run around the town quest time. Well, there's a shocker. I don't see Sumner anywhere, but there's Aruna. Maybe she's seen him. You should ask. Hello, my name's Amal and I'm your bartender. Freelancer. Nice to meet you. Did you recognize my voice when I said freelancer? Was I supposed to? Well, I was in season one of Dawn Guard, so I thought you might. Really? What was your character's name? Sentinel 2. Sentinel 1 got to open the gate, but I was always at his shoulder. Just in the first season? Yeah, in the second to the last episode of season one, I got killed by a scorpion. That's too bad. Yeah, but that's life, right? You gotta be tough if you want to be an actor. Who knows? Maybe you'll get another shot. You're probably right. I don't think Dongard appreciated me. Hey, you're pretty smart. I could use your advice. Okay. So there's this lady that comes to the bar and I think she's attracted to me. What makes you think that? She said, and I quote, I'm super attracted to you. So what's the problem? First, she's married. Second, to an aggressive Lancer. And third, I am terrible at saying no. How do you think I should handle this? Use your acting skills, establish firm boundaries. Uh... You need to clearly say no thank you and stay firm. Yeah, that makes sense. I just hate disappointing people, you know? Just keep it professional. If she doesn't let up, then ask your boss for help. Good thinking. Max knows how to deal with stuff. She sure does. You are a wise person. I'm not going to forget this. If I ever get into a jam, I know who I'll come to for help. Great. Good talk. Uh, didn't I just speak to you in another hallway? Ah, oh, freelancer. Let me guess. Looking for Matthias? Yes, one of them. He wanted a drink but wasn't allowed in. He's been banned from the premises for months. Great. So he's gone now. I tried to talk to him about the samples you found, but he didn't seem interested. He was always easily distracted, but never rude. He was odd. It's complicated. That one, Sumner, appears to be the abrasive side of Matthias. We well, should find him. I don't know how quickly the reality decay could set in. Got it. What now? I don't see Sumner anywhere. He might still have his link on him. Connect us. I can sense the link, but I can't seem to make the connection. But I can track him. Got him. He's by the forge. Notice the, the camera got really smooth in here. Like up until this room, it felt a little bit on the sticky side, but it feels quite nice in, in the bar. Probably to do with the amount going on outside, I suppose. Yeah. I knew it was going to end up going out the big gate. It should have just gone out the big gate in the first place.
You said Sumner was here. I don't see him. No? Hmm. Let me check the forge records. Ah. Looks like he took a javelin. Can he do oh, that? Yeah. Can he even operate one? Not well, I imagine. He has likely left the fort by now. You should go after him when you can, in case of trouble. Find Sumner at the forge. Uh, where about what? Locate Sumner at the manifold. All right, well we can try out our new javelin. Convergence. Well, we'll kick into a, a bit more action, even though we've hit the arm up. Seeing as how we're going to lose the ability to do any more of this at uh, the early hours of the morning. So we won't be able to do any more tomorrow. Left it a bit late in the day, people, to try this out. But never mind, eh? 22nd, I think it's out full, so it won't be that long if I decide to give it a whirl. I mean, after... After playing what I've played, I'd be pretty keen on getting it. I just would want to hear more about how interesting it is as you go on. Don't want to get bored after a few hours of playing it. That said, with Destiny, with all of its gripes that I had, I still got a lot of hours of gameplay out of that game. It's, uh, I never did play the most recent update. Ooh, we've got our extra 10% fly time as well. And our new guns and weapons, people. I'm tracking Sumner's position. Do you see it? Yes. Going after him. Ooh, check me out, people. Have you found Sumner yet? He left the fort. I'm trying to get to him. Hurry. Maddie's lost the ability to perceive time and space normally. What? It's complicated. I'll go as fast as I can. My well, cooldowns seem to, uh... Yeah, if you do a dive, you, you get cooler. Nice. Looks like he's stopped. You should be able to catch up. Yeah, you go to a nose dive, you get a bit more time. Easy. <laughs> Hit a wall there. I'm sensing something. Scars. Have a bit of lightning, eh? Have it. Jesus, that is an uber move, that. An that fire. Not overly convinced that I've uh, got a grenade on me, though. Unless that is my grenade. Ah, that's my RB move. Nice. Like it. Whoa, did not need to do that. Right, time for the Uber move, is it? Whoa! <laughs> What's going on? 
Oh, hello, that'll do it. Fire. Oh, that's brilliant, isn't it? Oh, that's outstanding. You can see a lot of people going this character. Just for that move. Low health. Whoa, feck me, what the hell was that? Come on, health, get up, up, up. The hell would they go? Just bring back the manifold in summer as soon as you can. Check this out. Going the wrong way, but. <laughs> well, that wasn't meant to happen. Oh, come on now. Well, that seems to suggest that I'm not allowed to go that way. I think we found the cave network that Sumner's in. Are you sure? No. I'm a cipher, not some kind of cavern oracle. I guess there's only one way to find out. Experience points are shared when you play with others. It allows you to level up faster. Whoa! Fucking hell. Easy there, big man. Oh, this is getting epic now, please. I'm sensing some strange energy. What's down there? I don't know. But Sumner has the manifold with him, and he came here for a reason. Hovering doesn't uh, overheat you quite so much, does it? How do you lower yourself, though? Freelancer, you there? 
On my way. I found what I'm looking for. Yes, the residents of this place is exactly what I need. Got a big move as it happens. Whoa, fuck it out, I'm nearly dead. Well, easy. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. Didn't like that, did he, eh? Bit of that action there, big fecker. Thank you. Oh, be careful. Absolutely leathered him with that move there. You're welcome, everybody. You mean steel? Oh, that's quite cool. This isn't using any heat at all. How'd I manage to do that? We need. Ah, it took someone with real nice. To... Oh, crud. Sumner, what's happening? Check that shit out. Wild, something unexpected about this place. I have to silence it, but I need time. A titan? No, more than one titan. Three titans. Wait, three. This what? Crashing manifold. It's doing it again. Leave it to me and fix that relic. Three titans. I've not got a big move. Come on now. Holy shit, I need back. <laughs> They're everywhere! Am I even doing any damage to this thing? Holy oh, easy, 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 easy. Well, what the hell is that? Shit me! Well, fire. It's not good, is it? Hang on now, shouldn't be able to hit the gun as well. Oh, that's what it looks like. Is. Why can't I? Oh, I must have been overheated. 
Somebody down over there, I think they are, aren't they? Fuck. help someone and I can't even see where they are. Must have respawned. Fucking hell. It's one down. Have it. Mine have got people, how do you change weapons back? Ah, I hold down X, got it. Have it! Fucking have it! Yeah! We need to get back to the others. Why do you sound so alarmed? What's happened? Woo! Check that shit out, people. Nice, that was good, that.
Kind of wish I'd started this earlier in the weekend now. A bit more time with it would have been nice. Although, to be fair, it might not do any more of the story now. Mmm, a little bit of pick up there then. Plenty of loot though, but plenty of things to add onto your weapons. And your armour for that matter. And we're back in the room. Not sure at what point it saves the game. Let's uh, go back out here for a sec. Finish up the story segment. getting worse. He's fragmenting. How can I help? It's all right. I made peace with it. This isn't just about you. It's the end of all of us if we don't do something. There's nothing to do. We don't have the answer. Maybe it was always supposed to end this way. <laughs> we could just let it be. Let it be. Yes, that's it. You genius. Get the manifold. <laughs> Freelancer removed it from its original housing after it affected the Dominion soldiers. And when we divide it, you severed the connection again out of fear. Courage. Hold on. Where are you going with this? Manifold needs more time. It needs to go through its full cycle. We're going to have to let the manifold complete what it started. Let reality settle. But if it settles, that means our division could become permanent. That's so bad. Certainly won't be dull. What do you say? Yet for a new adventure. Always. Okay. Click the switch. Oh. Uh, uh, right, right. Good, right? Rush. What a rush! I think it worked. I think it worked. No chance of liquefying. Time will tell. But now we have enough to help out with your Dawn Shield. Really? Yeah, especially with the data Sumner found. Does this mean that Matthias will never be whole again? Who says we are whole? Yeah, I had a feeling it was going to end up like that. You've completed your missions and helped Matthias with his search for the artifact. Thanks for playing. 
Continue playing by banding together with other freelancers to explore free play or face the challenge of the tyrant mind stronghold. There you go. So that's as much story as you'll get from the beta. Well, that's worked out quite nicely then. I mean, I realise we've gone into about an hour and a half worth of <laughs> an hour and a half's worth in this second part, but uh, it was good that. Actually, I really enjoyed it and I'm hoping that they release it to the folks who do the reviews and stuff nice and early so I can make my mind up as to whether or not to buy it. I'd be tempted. It's a really good... Uh, all right, love. Bloody hellfire. Walk right into me, why don't you? That second outfit was awesome. There's some uber power in that thing. Yeah, I mean, all in all, it's fantastic. It's not dissimilar to Destiny. I think this... If, if, it's, if you go into the open world and you can just fly around it without any loading screens and stuff other than getting dragged into battles if you're too far behind, then that would be absolutely awesome. But there was quite a lot of loading screens in the beginning section. I didn't find so many in that second section. But it was probably because I was keeping up with stuff. But yeah, absolutely brilliant. Really fun gameplay. Really fun looting system to this point. You can pick up loads of different gear. Be interested to see how in-depth that is. And how many items there are. But with their history of RPG and, and what have you, I'm hoping they've done it quite well. So there you are. Well, that's been an honour and a privilege serving for you in Anthem Demo, people. And we shall see what comes of the main game when it's launched on the 22nd of February. And I shall see you all next time. Take it easy, folks. Bye.